Oh, you're good. Before, before you guys start, 11 years, I've never sat and talked about referees in a press conference ever. Uh, I think Wes and TJ Luxmore do a great job tonight, actually, for 50-something minutes of the game. Uh, they call the high stick on Nas on Niederreiter, which might have been a high stick, but Niederreiter falls easy. We're arguing that it's a flop. They say it's still a high stick. Fair enough. Nas gets at five... 550 something on the clock. Niederreiter is hooking Nas up the boards. Um, you know, the puck turns over, we go the other way, they score. We're arguing that it's a hook. They're saying that Nas is flopping. We're arguing it's still a hook, just like they're arguing before. And it's unfortunate because that's a playoff game tonight. And, uh, you know, it's, it, it's very unfortunate that it comes down to that. Uh, like I said, I thought Wes and TJ did a great job up to that point. Um, and, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, it's a very competitive game. Power plays don't come come around very often, especially in games like this. And, and that's why I'm, I was happy Wes and TJ did a good job of letting us play all, all game tonight. Um, it's unfortunate it comes down to bounce like that. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, you know, whether a guy's been suspended numerous times or not, um, what's he going to carry around that heavy, heavy baggage forever? Uh, you know, I, I'm not saying that TJ and Wes were, you know, didn't call it for that reason, but, you know, Nas is a guy that's competitive and, and uh, whether he sold that call or not, you can look at the video and the stick is in his waist and that's why he loses the puck. Uh, I think it's unfortunate and I think it's, it's time for, you know, sometimes it's time for players to step up and, and speak our truth because, you know, I'm the one that looking like an idiot for getting thrown out of the game, even though I'm just, you know, just being honest and, I guess TJ didn't like that I said he had a tough night, um, but uh, that's the way it is. Anyways, Peter, go ahead. Yeah, I mean, we were just yelling from the bench, and I wasn't happy with him, and I guess I hurt his feelings. And unfortunately, you know, that's fine. He can kick me out. That's 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 his, you know, his call, and that's okay. Uh, yeah, I thought we played really good. I thought, you know, they came out really fast the first period like they always do in this building and I thought we did a good job of kind of weathering the storm um and uh you know we were able to push back towards the second half of that first period and really gain some momentum and second period was a really good period from us as well and, and even the third I think is back and forth they got a couple of power plays but um you know overall it's a that's a playoff type hockey game and and it was a fun one I thought our penalty kill was really good, uh, you know, and, and our power play was, you know, we had some good looks as well where, you know, we had some good looks in the first there on that first one. And, and even in the second period, we got a couple of scoring chances that, that are close to going in. Nas hits one out of midair that, that they just block on the goal line. Um, but, you know, that's one of their, the top, if not the top PK unit in the league, I believe they're in the top of the standing. So um, it's a good team over there, especially, you know, their special teams, but, I thought we, we had a strong game and just, you know, you know, they get a they get a bounce that goes in and an empty netter, and that's that's the way it is sometimes. What are our I think this possible? Uh just kind of got stuck on the walls tonight. Uh weren't able to really get the puck up top and move it and get some open looks. It just kind of rumbling around around the boards and and that's as a five-man unit on the other side of it that's where you want to keep it um but uh you know it's something we were working on and and uh something that definitely needs to get better going down the stretch but uh we know we've we've scored plenty of goals six on five and, and we know we we got the guys to do it so just something we got to stick with uh one of them I, you know fast game for sure uh you know they're a fast team and we're a fast team and that was a good matchup. Uh, it was fun, physical, and and you know, two good teams going at it. So yeah, it was fun. I thought he was really good, especially early on. He, I mean, he second period, and he didn't have a whole lot, a whole lot of shots at him. But I think in the first period, he did a great job of settling things down and and uh, you know keeping us in that game because they come up fast and hard in the first period, and and he made some big stops. Thanks, guys.
What do you think about the letter? Which two? Yeah, I think I, I think that Naz could have got a call um, on the one before the goal, for sure. Like he's climbing up, stick gets into him, wraps him up with free hand, all the above. And, didn't get the call, so it's what it is. I thought we played hard. They came out firing on all cylinders. Um, it's a team that's going to shoot the puck from everywhere. I think they lead the league in shot attempts, and they were buzzing in their own building. They rested the team. They came out hard. I thought it took us a couple minutes, and then we got our feet underneath us. We ramped up our competitiveness. Um, got better as the first went on, loved our second. Um, we got way more danger, spent more time in the offensive zone, gave up very little at the other end of the rink. Third period was played pretty even, competitive again, and they got a break. I mean, they threw one to the net, which is what can happen. And it hits, um, I think it hits Naz up high, way up by the, by the battle and changes direction and, and beats Kemp's, you know, so that's the difference in the hockey game. I thought it was a well-played hockey game by both teams, High, highly competitive, lots of pace, not a lot of room to move. That's why the score was 0-0. Zero, zero. I thought it was great. Yeah, well, I mean, we played hard. I mean, we we played real hard. We played well defensively. Um, yeah, I mean, we did some good things on the offensive side of it. We had our opportunities to put put one or two away to, to take a lead, and we missed on them. And I mean, they had some opportunities, especially early in the, in the game, to grab a lead, and they missed on them. Or the goalies made big saves. It was a good hockey game. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with it highly. I mean, it's the competitiveness and the skating is what we need and, and being on pucks and being disruptive and both five on five and on the penalty kill. And I thought he did that. He had a good night tonight. You know, you think about how many Yeah, I was. Yeah, I was looking at it. Um, just to me, I mean, it's got to be conclusive to overturn it. They've got it as onside. It was close. It was real close. I mean, his toes are on the – or one toe is on the line when he touches it outside the line, as far as I can tell. Um, and then he turns and throws it in. And he, his feet are in before the puck. But to me, it's like the possession play. Um, thought about it anyway just to see if we could get it overturned. But, I mean, I just couldn't come up with conclusive evidence to say it was. Yeah, it is correct. And it just depends on how many times they got to go back and break it out, really. You know, like it's the first, you know, a couple of the power plays that they had out there tonight, they they move it around, get a shot, there'd be a face off. So if they get that rest time, they can easily play the full two minutes. And if, uh, if they're doing the right things and get some of those opportunities, we'll leave them and let them change when they, when they need a break. But um, there was one in New Jersey where I felt like they could have came because they didn't have a lot going. They had to go back for a couple of breakouts, but it just kind of depends on the flow of the game and the flow of the, those two minute power plays. And if there's a whistle someplace around a minute and a half, I'll change them out. Um, but that hasn't seemed to be the case here. Yep. Thanks. Thanks.